Hello besties, welcome back to my YouTube channel and if you're here for the first time, my name is Tim Tilazi, popularly known as Tia Smith and I am back with another weekly vlog. Today is Friday the 10th of the month and I am on my way to firstly drop off a tender in the CBD and then secondly drive to Bless in Tembisa and then I need to find an outfit for tomorrow's event that I'm attending, I'm attending Mind Melt by no kulule covid lazy the lighting here is so bad um so better so i need to find leggings to wear to the event and then secondly i need to come back i'm attending another one the launch of novella and co in pretoria at five stay is gonna pick me up and drive there together so i need to come back home install my hair do my makeup um travel with her today and then also i might be traveling to durban tomorrow i'm not sure it's ta's birthday it's the love of my life's birthday and you know what i go all out for the love of my life so i'm hoping to fly to durban tomorrow after mind melt i knew that i wanted to fly to durban but her and i had agreed that we'll see each other on the 2nd of december when she comes so um but it's my girlfriend's birthday you know so I'm just thinking of flying in to, then then when we cancelled I decided to buy a ticket to um Mind Meld. I don't know how to pronounce it, but yeah, it's but fortunately it's in Tembisa also, kind of. Kind of what's this place? Kempton Park. It's in Kempton Park, sorry. So it's close to the airport. So what I'll do is tomorrow I'll just leave here with my bags to go to the event. The event ends at three and I'm gonna get like a late flight and then I'll just fly to Durban to see her for dinner and then come back in the morning. So that's what my itinerary looks like, but for now let's get to work. I can't find my AirPods case, hey, and it's frustrating me. But yeah, I can't stick around long enough looking for it. So let's get this party started. I got my work lines are done bro yesterday. And I got them done for 80 bucks. Didn't say I didn't plug y'all because in the north, Sana, I'm so tired of paying 250 for weak lines. These are stunning. I'm literally going out in them today because it's so hot. And yeah, the products that I'm using for skin brightening, I know you guys can tell the difference. In yellow bones, Sana, put yourselves on. They're called Glam Organic, and I'll leave their link in the bio. today morning best friends i hope you guys are well i look so scrumptious i'm on my way to the mind melt event i don't know if wearing my makeup was a great idea but you know what i wanted to look cute and scrumptious in my pictures um i went to the novella and co event yesterday but i left with my friend star and stay it's star's birthday ah! ba -ba -ba -ba. shout out to you my friend i love you so much I love you and your in-laws. <laughs> Screw. Kidding. I am. Um, yeah, I went there yesterday with Tay. And then. Sorry, I'm reaching out to this thing. Access granted. Yeah, it's a pen. Access granted. 
Woo, look at these little bit got today. So, we went there yesterday and I forgot my camera and my car, so I couldn't vlog. Uh, but I looked so delicious. I'm gonna insert pictures. And then, um, a little reel that I took just so that you guys can have an idea of what happened. <gasps> it is so hot! I'm wearing that Puma t-shirt. I didn't show you guys this Puma t-shirt. The other day I went to, um, Puma. I was looking for an outfit for Mind Melt. I remember when I edited my last vlog, I left that part out. Um, because I wasn't sure if I was gonna go or not. Then I went to Puma and then I got matching t-shirts for me and Mr. B. So, I'm gonna wear, I'm wearing this one today. Uh, with gym tights. The theme is active wear. So, I am quickly going to... Remember the other time I went to the coffee shop, I told you that I was meeting up with a friend. So... Um, I am going to, she stays in Durban as well. One thing about me, I love my Zulu girls. Uh, we had our first date that day at the coffee shop at like two vlogs ago. Yo, my eyes. And then I don't want to put on my vlog because it was just like, like, you know, it's our first date. I'm not trying to like, you know, make her uncomfortable, whatever. But I think you guys will see her today. Melody, Melody's from KZN. And then, yeah, so she flew down. It was her idea that we attend this event. I initially wanted to, Vale, like, guys, please forgive my camera because you guys won't see me from this end. But anyway, you'll see me just now. So it was her idea that we attend this event, and um, she flew down last night so that we could go today. And I, she's at Pantry by Jameli. Um, I'm going to see her. I'm running late. It's 8. I was supposed to get there at 8.30. She literally got there at, I mean, 7.30. She literally got there at 7.30, but I just had so many things to sort out at home. Okay, the robots are closed. So I had so many things to sort out at home, and that's why I'm just running a bit late. But I asked her to just order my food so that when I get there, my food is ready. And then we'll just stay there for the next 30 minutes. Jamel is like 10 minutes away from my place, so I'll be there just now. And then from there, we will drive to the venue together. And I am seeing my best friend for her birthday. So I am flying to Durban today. So I'm flying up to Durban after this event. So from the event, I'll drive back home. I haven't even packed. So smart of me, guess Sana. Yo, Ika Econ, before I'm going to be like Max Econ, Sana. Um, okay, now you guys won't hear me. But yeah, I'm flying to Durban. Let's go to Jameli. Let's go have breakfast as pretty girls. Go to my melt. Work on our mental health. Scrumptious events. And then from there, we are airport girlies. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Quite an exciting weekend for me because I look so good yesterday. I look so good today. I'm going to look good tomorrow. You know the vibes. I haven't felt this good in a minute. I was down bad. Okay, wait. Wait, wait. Wait, 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 gosh, my bitch. I was down bad, I was recovering, I was in and out of hospital, I was writing exams, I was just mad. Nah. So, I am going to have the time of my life. I haven't had alcohol since September, so, hmm, I don't know if I feel like breaking my alcohol virginity or what. Not even virginity, first child, celibacy, okay? Um, but I don't think so. I really hate how alcohol makes me feel. But my friends need to start believing that I'm not grand. Like, Ste, for example. Ste does not drink alcohol, like, ever. So every time we're out, like, it'll be like, one virgin, please, and then, like, the normal one. No, I'm just like, two virgins, please. And then she'll just be like, girl, what's going on? And I'm like, girl, you know, she'll be like, ah, friend. She literally kind of like forced me to get an alcoholic one just to prove that I'm not pregnant. But that's just a cool code. Like, you know, it's not that deep. But she'll be like, ah, friend, you're not telling me are you pregnant or what? Get an alcoholic one. Then I have to get like one alcoholic to balance, you know? But the, I, she understood it was okay. October was October. But now October's finished and we're in November. And she's like, mm, the mastic side eye. But I'm not pregnant yet, okay? So it's like, am I still going to like enjoy Obushabami or what? But anyway, I'm really in a good mood today. So let's get this party started. Let's get this started. And I look so scrumptious. I look so good. I ah, feel like good. You guys should see my body. Ah, body, somebody, somebody. Ah, this is B. 
Like, this is someone's wife, bro. And this installation ate it up. This installation ate it up, my nigga, for 400 bucks. Damn. I went to here by Nini in uh, Maboning. And that's because I had a tenant to drop off in the morning. I don't know if I told you guys this, but yeah. I had a tenant to drop off in the morning, and it was in the CBD. So I had to go to Bliss, which I ended up not doing because Bliss is on the other side of the world. And I was just like, okay, is it my hair or my nails? But my nails were not so bad because one thing about Bliss, your nails will not break. They will grow. But they will not break. Oh, Jehovah. I forgot my license in the other car. Um, but anyway, she, what was I saying? Bliss, right? So I was like, okay, my nails are like growing out. But they didn't break. So they don't look too bad. I can really like literally get away with it. So, okay. I can get no i didn't do my nails what are you saying Timo? i did my hair so i told bless i'm like bless i'm just going to do my hair quickly because i knew i'd not have time to like sit down and install my own hair yeah bo? so then she was like no it's okay i'll see you on monday so i'm going to literally make sure that these nails don't break this weekend just so that i can like wing it until monday you know so i did my hair this guy gave me like lights This guy gave me like these two lines, that hairstyle that I did in Cape Town, but with straight hair. Ah, ate it up, child. I told him it's going down this weekend. It's going down. Guys, so on this side, I just don't want to show you, is my friend's salon, Touched by October Beauty. Ah, my girlies are doing it. My girlies are winning. My girlies are pretty. Like everything. My friend is opening a salon. She's doing so well. Shout out to you, my friend. Say, love you, Lou. Um, so every time I drive down here, like I see her salon, I'm just like black girl magic. Okay, love me some black girl magic, and she's my friend. Ah! Anyway, I'm just a natural source of egg teller, but anyway, it's like umo ya um, umo ya um. Ah, umo ya we itila wa shumo. It ain't been egg guys. be church in my car but anyway guys i'm really looking forward to have a great day and i'm gonna bring you guys along we're gonna have such a scrumptious day ah uh, ah uh, ah uh. okay bye guys Showtime. I got a strong team. I got a strong team. I and for the men, I've been to the moon, I'm so fun at the very Thank you so much. Well, I need to glitter. What is Zori? I'm telling you, I'm telling you. But I don't think I'm going to go for my classes. Like, I'm going to go for like a week. Or like Just a day. to perfect your craft now. You should go back. Uh, my class is gone. <laughs> myself <laughs> I said no no I said for me like especially if I travel like what am I gonna do with this and book even installing sense of when I got you got you got you guys I'm so late and I'm only eating now mouth done eating I'm done, like she's very late. That's not a slow eater, but, but like she's fast. looking gorgeous, so I understand. It's like, okay. I'll let it slide. <laughs> <laughs> I'll let it slide. So I'm gonna talk for now. She's 
team is just eat. So I'm not gonna go there, guys. Okay, guys. And so when I'm going to be in, I'm feeling like so. I'm feeling so good. Yes, I was I was tempted to go out, but then I was like, eh, I'm getting full. Yeah, full of sin. I was like, I'm getting full of sin. I was like, no, let me just sleep. Let me just sleep. Who says it again? My skin is glowing. I look so. You look so pretty. It's a soft up for me. Like it's a soft up. Like. I look so pretty. <laughs> My skin is glowing. Like, uh, I'm acting like chill on gas, but I'm not chill. 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 I'm not <laughs> I'm actually so excited, guys. Yes. It looks very yeah. interesting. Same. And the goodie bags. What do you want? Exactly, because I know that she loves Dio. I'm excited to see. Him. Yeah, I want to see. Who's on what's the way to see makeup be the guys? Some boys in the tour are they are big, yeah. They are big, na. Clam pa malik siro, see clam pa. Yeah, just shy. Oh my, yo, that was so nice. It's so good at the country. Tiamo told me about this place. That's why we're here, and the food is so nice. Like I think every time I come to Joburg, give us a lot for breakfast. They have coming. I'm an energy. I'm up saying Jelly Linda. And down and get out. You can out for lunch. Lunch is a lot better. Oh, they have the best. Where? Upstairs. Upstairs, yeah. It's nice food. Amazing. No one finds anything like that in the town. Really? Where are we then? Jamaica. And like the place. Bryanston. Okay. Yeah. Bryanston. This place is nice. You know what? I'm glad I ate. Okay, let me eat just a little bit more this half. Okay. Oh, you never made a person. Mm -mm. I used to be like that. Like, mm -hmm. either like, myself will live in a 12. I'm going to have a gym. 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 Yo, I can tell I'm so much younger. Hey, I like so much. What the guys? I'm going to go and get some chicken. I'm going to get some chicken. I'm going to get some chicken. You guys haven't seen her stand up. You guys haven't seen her stand up. But singing chicken. Sure, this is quite intense. So when they said it was chocolate, I thought I was excited. 
It's completely getting as a jumping castle for me. Like, how cute! <laughs> she literally got us a jumping castle. I think that's such a. Cute I left my thing. camera in the car, but we had lunch, and um, I'm quickly rushing out because I'm flying to the airport. Flying to the airport, driving to the airport. So yeah, they're still gonna like cruise in the jumping castle, and I'm gonna miss out on that. But we got blankies, and I dirtied my white shirt. So that's that. Bye guys. Guys, my skin. Get into my skin. I came in here and I face beat. And then something happened and I cried. One of the sessions. And then like my makeup was just... So I took it off. And then fortunately there was Dermalogica. They were offering um, facials. Well, I just put it... I just used wipes. And then, um, yeah. I removed my stuff and then put on stuff. So let's go to airport and go to Durban. Hello, best friends. I am from the event. I'm just changing to a pretty pink dress, and I'm on my way to the airport with my boyfriend. Hi, baby. How are you? Yes, I have my people. Hi, Mr. V. Hello. How are you? Bye. How have you been? Where have you been? I'm good. I'm around. So was. Cool. Cool, No worries, lovely seeing you. Don't come on. Don't come on. Yeah, I will come on. I really expect you to say, mm mm, near visa. Bye bye. Get to the other eh. I'm sure I'll have visa. Bye bye. Wow, that's me, nice. Just never know what to do. I'm your only friend, ne? Just never know what to do. Am I your only friend? Am I your only friend? Yeah. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm my husband's only friend, Shem, and I feel bad for leaving him today, but... So, what right? Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's my turn today. Every second day for the past two months, I've been dropping you off at the airport. <laughs> yeah, it's my turn. You guys know every time I'm on the way to the airport to go pick up Mr. B. I'm on the way to the airport to go pick up Mr. B. You must feel it. Today, he's dropping me off, but I'm back tomorrow. Let's go. my OOTD is a dress from Edgar's my small bag as usual my Ted Baker and pink shoes and that's what I look like I just want to get to a gift but I'm not finding anything I like here and guys hotel come has been on no service like this whole time ever since I got off my flight it's been saying no service so short to me, I'm gonna be stuck at the airport. Uh -oh, guys, and this Wi Fi doesn't work. The bank. I'm Give you guys a room tour at myself. I haven't seen anything, but this place was so cute. And this is me, and that's the bathroom, and that's the bedroom. It's so cute. And yar, oh my god, it's so cute. It smells delicious. Oh, oh. Don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it. Don't play with it. I just wanna rough neck nigga on the tongue. Big you just wanna send me automatic with a drum. Hit me if I'm finished now, protect me, gun. I ain't giving out no nutty to no nigga just for fun. Are you dumb? Uh uh.
I just prepared breakfast for everyone. I woke up, I washed the dishes, I cleaned up while everyone was sleeping because I'm just wholesome like that. And then I made sure everyone has food, so they've woken up and it's cute. And they're about to eat. Courtesy of who? Mama B. Mama B. Yeah. yeah, sometimes we laugh and sometimes we cry, but I guess you know now. Yeah. Baby, yeah. I took a half and she took the whole thing. Slow down. Ooh, I look cute. Hi, besties. Happy Monday and happy new week. I am back from Durban. Hey, I'm going to get a little bit If you follow me on Instagram, you would know that I had the worst flight experience ever yesterday. I don't really want to get into it now because I'm driving and I'm running a little late. I'm from the office um, and I'm on my way to lunch with a child, my childhood best friend and her mother. So Tato and I went to primary school and high school together and she's just a pretty yellow bone girl like myself and people always thought that we were siblings and we were raised as siblings, you know. Um, we were best friends since grade one. And then kind of parted ways when I had to leave my first high school in grade 9 to go and join a new one in Mpumalanga. So a lot of people, one, think I'm from Mpumalanga because I did grade 10, 11, and 12 in MP. And my dad stays there, but I'm not from there. So Tata and I were friends from grade 1 until grade 10. So for a good, a good 10 years of friendship, and her mom really raised me. And, um, you know... It's her mother's birthday today and I like we always talk we're not that close anymore um, because of course like you know life happens and then not that you outgrow each other no bad blood like but we aren't friends and we haven't we are I don't know how to quit, how to put it in a nice way but I haven't seen them in years and I've always said to her that I'd really like to do something nice for you know her mom like her mom really raised me you know so it's kind of like you know when you grow up now you are bougie and you forget people that raised you well and people that really loved you and shame I get I'm one of those people I really don't forget a good gesture and like amazing treatments you know Ngangi Ngani Botat so um, Mother's Day we tried I booked them into the spa but they couldn't make it and then now uh, she texted me yesterday and said hey it's mom's birthday tomorrow so if you still are up to like you know doing something for her please let me know and I was like great let me see you for lunch so i'm on my way to they stay closer to um papa chino clear water they stay closer to clear water so it's fine i said i would meet them there so i'm on my way to papa chino's and the reason i picked up my camera is because i am at randberg fruits and veg market i discovered this place like a long time ago when i still used to stay in the area and then it's right up the road from our office so it's on republic road so as I was driving from the office, I quickly remembered that this place sells flowers for such a reasonable price. And if at that time they were so cheap, the price today, which would have been more than what they charged at that time. Like, I don't even understand if I'm making sense, but I got, let me show you the bouquet first. I got this bouquet. So stunning, right? I got the flowers separately. I got the jibs separately. And then they just wrapped it up for me. These are 20 stem roses. And then I got the jibs and then with the ribbon. Can you guys guess the price of this very stunning bouquet? If you're in Randburg, you want to gift a friend, you want to gift yourself, show yourself some self-love, or if you're watching this with your girlfriend, and then on the day that she's not around, you go and get her flowers here. No? Um, I bought these for, I literally even kept the slip so I could show you guys, $164.99. So $165 is what I got these flowers for. Like, I'm not bashing my Instagram boutiques at all, or well, my Instagram florists. I love them with my whole heart. But I'm just saying, pay for the um, Instagram stuff when you, like, can't get them yourself. But if you can, this would save you a lot. So I remember that. I wanted to get a flowers. I initially thought that I want to pass by a Woolies. But I remember that this is even more, like, you know, sentimental and cute. And imagine them. Also, when I got home from the airport yesterday, my man had um, roses for me, which was so great because um, my man and I have always had a problem. Not always had a problem. My man likes buying me um, getting into a mixed mixed roses, mixed but like a mixed veggie flower. Maraki mixed veggie flower, and I really am not a fan. And I and I eventually like decided to have that conversation with him some time ago. Got to go in. 
you know what do, I don't want to say that like I don't appreciate your gestures of getting me flowers I really do but I just don't like those flowers you know if possible please just buy me like plain roses um, you know please just get me plain roses and that's what I really really love and it took us a while to get there but I got home yesterday he was supposed to pick me up from the airport with the roses when I almost lost my life and I couldn't get them at the airport so when I got home the flowers were there and I was just like so geeked I was like oh my goodness you finally got me roses that I love so yeah that was so sweet of him if Lena is watching this vlog it's um it's a plug for him as well to come and get me roses from that place also guys can you tell that my skin is lighter than it was because of the skin brightening products that I've been using they are working on a girl's face like leave it to bleach the bleach sounds so bad it's just skin brightening you're just brightening your complexion and I love it for myself like I look so good my skin looks so fine and also I combine those products with a facial so the glow also comes from the products but also from you know like me getting a facial done and I think it's so scrumptious so the combination is delicious combination of facial combination of glow products combination of everything you know I really have this stubborn pimple that will not go away but besides that can your skin look like this on a regular regular during the week I think not so let's go see Tata and her mom and have lunch and catch her on the flip side guys and geek cards hey hey I really want to give you a story time about what happened on the flights, but I need to like sit down, so I'll probably do it when I get home. See ya later. Often, but since recruiting isn't an 
Today is a Thursday and I am finally on my way to Bliss. I just quickly stopped by Plata to get us coffee because I need a child. I, I haven't had coffee in a minute and in order to get my day started I have so much to do. Um, so I'm traveling to Mapumalanga tomorrow. If you guys remember, I know my dad's not going to watch this, I hope so. And you guys don't go and tell my dad this. but. The surprise party thing that I spoke about when I was cake shopping the other time. I was cake shopping for my dad. I'm planning my dad's surprise birthday party. But I remember in the vlog I said I'm planning a surprise for a friend. And I didn't want my dad to catch if he ever did watch. Because he usually watches like my Instagram. I'm not sure about YouTube. But everything I do on YouTube, on Instagram, my dad knows about, you know. So, um... What you call? So it's his surprise birthday party this Saturday, and I am so proud of myself. If anything, wait, I'm gonna have to tie my belt. <whistles> wait, who's doing like this, guys? Kuningi and Ngi Wan. Yeah, guys, I'm having a whole lot of car chats with you a lot lately, and I kind of like them. Like every time I edit, I really, really like the car chats. But um, yeah, it's my dad's birthday party this Saturday. His initial birthday is on the twenty third. But I am not going to be available on the weekend of the 25th. And so is like everyone else that was helping me plan. Okay, not everyone else. So my aunt, my two aunts and my uncle were helping me plan my dad's birthday party. I'm so grateful for them because like there's nothing. I don't even know the deco lady's number. I don't even know the caterer's number. I don't know the venue people's numbers. Nothing. My aunt was just handling everything. And then she'd come back and say, okay, this is how much, this is how much. And I just pay, you know, because I really have a lot on my plate. And sometimes people that have a lot on their plate also deserve people that will like lessen their burdens you know and that's what my aunt has been shamed like yo I, that's one thing I didn't have to stress about all I had to stress about was actually having the finances to make it happen and I'm so grateful like you know guys God has like the perfect timing um, remember I'd always say yo I wish invoices paid in time immediately after you do your work whatever but invoices paid late and I was just like okay all of the work that I did in August the money is gonna come like um, August September, October, September, October is when I've just been getting paid for my campaigns and I was like what better way than to like celebrate my dad's 60th birthday, my dad's turning 60. So what better way, like I just felt like giving back to my dad and you know just doing something nice because I remember, what was I doing? Oh my 9 to 5, with my 9 to 5 back when I was in final year, this was 2021, I was 20 years old. I did something nice for my mom for her birthday and I got her a tombstone. When I was 20, my mom would have been with, she passed away when she was two, and then two plus four. It was her 55th birthday, it was my mom's 55th birthday in 2021. And I just wanted to do something special for her, but she was not around and I just put her tombstone. So this time around, my dad's turning 60 and I really would like to celebrate my dad. I am a daddy's girl. It's just so unfortunate that like we stay apart, but she, if you know, you know, you know. I'm a daddy's girl, so I'm so excited for his birthday party. But now, so his birthday on the 23rd, I'm not going to be there on the 21st. My aunts that were helping me plan this party are not going to be there on the 21st because they're attending a wedding. So we just actually thought it's best to just make that birthday party a weekend before his actual birthday. His birthday is next week, Thursday, so a week away from now. Um, yeah, so now it's this is that it's just that the timing of my exams is off. I haven't I had an exam yesterday, I have an exam tomorrow and I have an exam on Saturday on the day of the actual birthday party, but at least it's in the morning. So I'm not gonna be able to travel like early and on time for everything and to help prep, but my aunts are travelling to uh, my dad's hometown tomorrow. They're travelling to Omelo. My dad knows nothing. He doesn't know we're gonna be around. He doesn't know I'm coming down. He doesn't know anything. Like he's just, you know, his friends are keeping it on the low. And you know, I've I've always wanted a surprise party for myself. But now I can imagine like the joy and you know, people that just intentionally care about you, like people that just like intentionally um, took out their money, their time, their effort, their resources to just come and celebrate you. So 
I'm quickly going to uh, to bled to get my nails done for the weekend and I have to run whatever errands that I have to run today because tomorrow is our uh, tomorrow to my exam in the morning and then Mr. B and I will be traveling after so yeah that's really exciting for me and this vlog is gonna come out before the actual party so that's why I give it guys I don't know if you know my dad but don't tell my dad <laughs> and I know he's not gonna watch this so yeah um, I'm excited about that and my family is gonna be there everyone's gonna be there like just everyone coming in to celebrate someone that you love you know so I have we have all our family members over and you know the Smith side of the family and his maternal side of the family like everyone's gonna be there it's scrumptious so everything is sorted deco lady catering um, cake cake I said I'll pick up on Saturday that side um, what else for my hair, I just have a hair installation video that I have to do, so I think I'll just use that hair. And the theme is all white, and I will be vlogging all of that. So I'll see you guys next week with the vlog, yeah, Pat. But yeah, I was saying I haven't had time to go to Bless because I had such a busy week, and remembering that I was supposed to go to Bless on Friday at the beginning of this vlog. But anyway, let's go, guys. My skin. I'm gonna need you guys to get onto Glam Organics. Like, I'm really gonna need you guys to get onto Glam Organics. As I said, I'm working with them and I'm on a journey of like skin brightening. And I really love the glow. I really just love my complexion. And you know, I am ovulating and I am on like um, some meds that are like for hormonal balance. So I kind of am breaking out a bit, but just a bit. I know it's not them, but like it's it, they it does the work it does what it has to do it's brightening my skin it's making my skin glow and i really really love it so yeah i just wanted to let you guys know i'm going to bless i ramble a lot i get carried away when i'm in the car and i ramble a lot so let's go guys i'm kind of just like sleeping on the job i got to bless and I got so comfortable and I forgot that I'm YouTubing and like vlogging. I'm watching K on, so I've got my airport on. And K I was talking about like I haven't been like vlogging in a minute and and and, and I'm like, oh what else did I vlog? An hour ago. <laughs> so I'm getting my nails done, child. Some what? Some French. Some French whites. Oh, oh it's bad. <laughs> It was it was really, really bad. Yeah. So yeah, let's get pretty guys. This is before shaping, and it really looks so good. Can you tell? Nobody's gonna know. Anyway, hi girlfriend. Hi. How are you? Good. Sorry about my hair. Guys. <laughs> That's it's a rough life. That was me with my nails, <laughs> child. Rough, 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 rough. <laughs> so. Dad, I really love this bob. Like, you can just put it on and look cute, okay? It looks very nice. Thanks, baby. You say nothing's wrong at all, baby. I say that we're falling off, baby. Maybe we just ain't been on the same page. In my mind, I'm down by it. In your heart, you can't try it. Good morning, Kiki. <laughs> the lady, the the lady, are are. You got a call from Kiki. Hi, Kiki. <laughs> I have my earphones on. So it's like, oh, you got a call from Kiki. Hi, Kiki. Not Kiki. <laughs> Really hard, maybe the difference will be, I'm on the call now, he's thinking, you're gonna get in trouble because you're thinking, you're gonna get in trouble already. Oh, CD Pie. <laughs> Guys, look at my nails. Look at my nails. So scrumptious. Guys, I actually really love this set. It's probably like my third time with the set this year, yeah? If not fourth time. 
but yeah, I love it so much. Bless eight. Yeah. Bless eight. Woo! Bless eight. My girlfriend, he eight. And these are my natural nails, just overlaid. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Guys, your natural nails look this good and healthy. <laughs> Holly Dowdy. <laughs> Holly done it, come and see, please. Bum, be, bum, be, bum. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Thanks, sugar. You're welcome. Oh, I'm my I'm in the spa, Diana. And I'm carrying my elder bag. Slinking gifts and this dress from China Moore. I got it for 100 grand. And it looks so delicious. Looking hot. I want it in every color. I have it in black, but. Uh, again, yeah, in every color I want. Let's go! Guys, I'm trying to mold my brand and I think I found the perfect dress for tomorrow's all white party. Well, Saturday's all white party. Especially with the bar that's giving dreamy. And then I also have this option, but I feel like it's been overworn. I think this is nice and different. Hey. This is the second dress, but it's, it's so short. Like, I'm gonna be mad and comfortable. That body, though. 